Hi all, Karthik here from Design School by WP Algorithm. First of all, I want to wish you all a very happy new year and we're lucky to survive 2020. Anyway, today's topic is all about page effects scroll or page scroll effects. So if you have dynamic content plugin, well, you can simply click on the settings cog under general settings, you'll find a tab called page scroll. Now you have different scrolling settings. And when you toggle it on, there are different kinds of scrolls. One is the FX scroll, which we're going to talk about in this video. Then there's snap scroll and inertia scroll. There'll be separate videos on these two. So stay tuned for that. Right now, we'll be focusing our attention to FX scroll. Now, FX scroll works flawlessly with most of the themes and the themes that actually work with Elementor. Right now, I'm rocking Astra theme. So here's a home page built with Elementor and it's actually an Elementor template as you all can see. I'll just toggle this FX scroll on. And one more thing to note, whenever you switch between theme, you have to toggle this on and off just to make sure that this actually works. And as I toggle this on, right now I just have a custom class. I'll just remove this. I'll update and reload the page. We'll talk about custom section class in a bit. As the page reloads, I'll just click on the settings cog again. I'll click on page scroll. I'll just toggle this on and off. And now you can see that the effects scroll or page scrolling effects take place. Now, in motion effects, you have to individually set it across the whole page or per section or per widget. But here you just can enable them at page level. So it's quite simple. Right now, I have three kinds of animations. And as I scroll through the page, you can see them in action. You can also add as many animations as you want. So it will be combination of all these effects but it's always a good idea not to have too much of motion see that so as I scroll through there's this near little zigzag effect in addition to opacity and you can mix and match between various effects that you really need all you need to do is to click and select different kinds of effects that you want now you can also remove this whole effect on the first row so the effects start kicking in from the second row as you scroll through as you can see here there is no effect on this particular section it starts from second section if you toggle this on and you can also limit these effects to particular section class so i'll just click on the section go to advanced and i've added a class called my trans to the first four sections so this section my hyphen trans you can give any class that you want and even the second section has this class. Even the third section has this class. Go to advanced and just type in any class name that you want. You can add multiple class names separated by spaces. And even the fourth section has this class, right? The fifth section, which is the fine food cuisine, doesn't have this. So I can simply enable the page scrolling effects only on those classes all i have to do is to just paste my class name so the effects will be applied only to this class but not the whole page or whichever section has this class name the page scrolling effects will be applied only to those sections as of now i'll just toggle this on and off once just to make sure that this works properly you may also have to reload it just to make sure that it refreshes and works properly. And you can see that the effect is not applied to the section starting from fine food cuisine, right? All the sections below it don't have that animation, only the sections above it. So particularly the sections that have this class name have this animation. See that? You can apply any kinds of effects or any sets of effects that you need, right? Just pick the effects that you need. And you can also enable it on desktop, tablet, or mobile devices. Or if you want effects to be on maybe alternate sections or specific sections, 
just give them a class name and put that class name here and boom magic and i've tested this out with generate press ocean wp it works pretty well with most of the compatible themes without any issue let me know what you guys think in the comments down below that's it for now so this is paid scrolling effects in action of dynamic content plugin if you don't have dynamic content plugin you can get it from the link in the description i'll catch you in the next one until then peace